What's up guys, Dar Sizzle here from Dar Sizzle Offshore. And first and foremost, I wanna wish you guys, well, I hope you guys had a very happy and safe Thanksgiving and just reminisce what you're thankful for this time of the year, especially, you know, 2020 is such a crazy year. But I figured I would go ahead and make a video for y'all today, even though I'm with family hanging out this weekend, but we got a bunch of fish in the cooler. And I gotta clean for the holidays and I'm so excited. By the time you guys see this, We'll already eat, we, we have already eaten all of these fish. So we got a beautiful wahoo, dolphin, mutton snapper, sheep's head. We just slayed the fish, back to back days fishing, and now it's filet day. So we're gonna pull out the beautiful wahoo we caught. There he is, check him out, gorgeous fish. Guys, I hope you saw that video. We crushed the fish that day, and we got a KDW offshore slam. KDW, kingfish, dolphin, wahoo. All right, so here's our wahoo. And before we dive into filleting this bad boy, just want to tell you really quick about my Black Friday specials. And I'm going to link all this information down below for you guys as well. But don't forget, I have a sale going on on my pre-ordered 2021 Dar Sizzle calendars going on right now. You can save 10% on your purchase and get a free Dar Sizzle sticker with every calendar purchased. Once again, that code is going to be down below. Actually, there won't even be a code. It'll be available on sale on my website right now. So just go over there and buy it. Don't forget about my code for the bracelets. You can get awesome fish hook and anchor bracelets hand tied by me, adult and child sizes, unisex as well. It's just up to you if you're a man and you want to wear one. My code today is 342. So you're going to buy, you're going to get three for the price of two. So you're going to get the code is three, number three, F O R, number two. And that's going to be down below. So you're just going to put three bracelets in your cart and then use the code and it'll work and you'll get a discount. So check that out down below. Keychains, eight by tens, apparel, dar sizzle apparel, beautiful sterling silver necklaces. I also got these on sale for 10% off as well today. So that is gonna be down in the description for the, the sterling silver necklaces. Um, that was a lot, I know, I'm sorry y'all. But just go down below. Everything that you're gonna need is gonna be right there for you. All right, so let's dive into this beautiful Wahoo. We got sushi today using my seven inch filet knife. And they're pretty easy to filet. Just wait till you see this meat though. It is out of this world amazing. And we're just gonna turn that knife around, follow that fish all the way down. And we're just gonna take our time here because you know, wahoo is a wahoo. And they're so, they're probably the best tasting fish out there in my opinion. They're just so good, delicious raw. I love to eat raw sushi or raw wahoo. <laughs> there we go, just pop that through. Same knife. And then I'm just gonna kind of follow the edge of the bones here. I can feel it with my blade and I can feel it going down and it's got a little bit of flex in the blade as well, which is exactly what I want. And then we got the pin bones up here that you always gotta break. Make sure you have an extra sharp knife when you're filleting any type of fish because a sharp knife is way safer than a dull knife. And then get to his backbone here and then we're just gonna curve that knife right back down and follow his meat. Oh, do you see that meat? Look at it, freaking delicious. This is gonna be so good. We have a feast. There we go. I would usually break it up in two if he was a little bit of a bigger fish, but that was just easy enough to do, you know, with a nice 10 pound wahoo right there. All right, so now we got our big, beautiful wahoo filet right there. And don't forget about the code on these as well. They have an awesome Black Friday sale going on too. And they already have a discount on their website. So all you gotta do is just plug in my code, darsizzle 15 and save additional money on their, on their stuff. So check it out. And that'll be down below as well. So now I just switched my blade to the nine inch. I probably could use a seven, but I like the nine inch. Just give me a little more room when I'm skinning this fish. And skinning this fish is a little more difficult than most. Um, it's not a very thick skin at all. It's very similar to like kingfish, so you can cut through it fairly easy. So you just gotta keep your knife a little up and kind of follow it all the way down. And I'm just checking as I go along just to make sure I have the right angle here. It's kind of like almost like a shark too. You keep the blade up a little bit instead of angling it down. And you sacrifice just like a millimeter of meat. It's not a big deal, but this is coming off and it's looking amazing. It's gonna be so good. Wahoo is just like the best and you can't overcook it either because if you overcook it, this fish is like pure muscle. And if you overcook it, it becomes real dry. So you just gotta take your time with this fish if you like to cook Wahoo. We like to light pan sear it too. And we're gonna make some amazing meals. 
All right, let's see what we did. Not bad at all. Nice. And there's our beautiful fish, as you can see. We bled this wahoo, so he doesn't have a very big bloodline. But let's just go ahead and break out his loins so I can show you how beautiful these loins look. They're like glistening in the middle. It's so pretty. I just take extra care of any fish I keep because I want to respect the fish that I keep. And, you know, I know it's a really fresh, delicious fish. I took care of it. So we're just knocking that out. Just removing a little bit of bloodline because, like I said, we bled him. And I would say you bleed most fish just because they'll always taste better when you bleed them when they're alive and you get all, most of the blood out. So there wasn't much bloodline at all. You see there's hardly any waste. We got two beautiful bottoms and top loins here. Now let's just make a cut, probably like right here. Make a cut right here. And you can just see, I don't know if you can see it, we have like a really overcast day here in Florida. You could just see like it glistening. Look at those loins, just absolutely beautiful. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> but there is our Wahoo filet, as you can see, did a great job. So that's about it, guys. I'm only gonna filet one side for you today because I do the same exact thing on the other side of this fish and you've seen me do this a thousand times. But like I said, I hope you guys had a very, very happy Thanksgiving. And I am visiting my sister up in Gainesville. So just continue to pray for Megan. As you know, I'll link that information down below for the GoFundMe. And just have a safe, happy weekend. And don't forget, if you want to support a small business like me, I would highly appreciate it. And everything is made by me, like we talked about. So until next time, there's pudding, follow your dream, and keep on catching. <laughs>